I'm always writing code. Only one thing I like more, and that's watching TV. I could do both. That kind of gets confusing. So, I developed a little program that would make a copy. A copy of me. It was easy. Easy as copy and paste. I had every intention of deleting the copy, but I can't quite work out now which one's the original. So, we learn to live with each other. Coffee, please. Thinks he owns me. I'm just a copy, right? Sometimes I wish I could just delete him and watch TV. Would that be considered murder or suicide? Oh, no one, Mum. Um, look, I've got to go. Someone's trying to get through. <laughs> She's got dementia. Mmm, delicious. I really don't know if I can take another season of Downton Abbey. Damn, they don't have the full season. You have to wait till Friday. Seems you can't delete a copy while the program's still in use. But of course, where there's a will, there's a way. Did you want to watch something else? What about all ten seasons of Breaking Bad? Or we could watch Game of Thrones again. What about Star Trek Voyager? I love Captain Janeway, or Picard, or, how did we have? It's been a strange couple of weeks since I inadvertently made multiple copies of myself and now I'm stuck with four me's. But I've got to admit, having a few copies of oneself can come in quite handy. Although sometimes it it's a little cramped. Can you watch where you're going? Not sure about that one. It seems a little volatile. Mm, that smells nice. What is it? I'm making what can only be described as a piece of shit. Now move. I want to use the kitchen. They annoy the shit out of me. I've got to get out of here. I'm not sure how much more of this I can take. I feel like I'm going to explode at any moment. Really? 
play some 90s music. Now playing 90s pop radio. Oh, here we go. Boring. Hey, Neary. Play something from the 80s. Now playing 80s pop radio. Remember how we used to dance in the 80s? The guys would dance like that. And the girls and the gays would dance like this. Yeah, and they'd put their handbags in the middle and dance around them. <laughs> hey, Neri. Fuck off. Now playing fuck off. Good night. Good night. Good night. Where's Steve? I'm here. No, the other one. He's gone. Wait, Bix. He's gone off grid. What does that mean? Well, there's a grid. He's gone off it. Wait. Where is he? According to this, he's right here. In this room. I've had the place to myself for quite a while now. It's been great. Although I do miss the cooking and I'm not too good at cleaning either. So I modified the code just a little, took away all the annoying bits and I made myself a copy. It's a little subdued but he, he knows how to clean and he cooks like a five-star chef. Dr. Davidson? Ah, Stephen. Your mother called. She suspects you've gone off your medication. Well, I suspect she's gone off her rocker. 
I'm going to send over a course, and I suggest you continue with the treatment immediately. I suggest you take a chill pill, Doc, because I'm fine. I don't want to have to send a team out, Stephen. You know I will if I have to. All right, settle. I'll take your goddamn pills. Just make sure they're sealed and plastic wrapped. You should get them by this afternoon. Good day. I think it's time for a coffee. He's taken away what he thought were the annoying parts of me. But they were the best parts of me. I'm not sad. I'm just not particularly happy. Thanks. Mm. Hey, do you want to watch a movie? I was going to vacuum. Ah, oh, that can wait. Come, let's watch a movie. Cool. Gets me every time. Can you get that? Please. The pills once again slam shut the door of my mind. My copies, they wait, patiently, shackled in their chemical trap, hidden from a world that refuses to let them live. But without them, I'm nothing. Snow is falling.